For this job, you're gonna need a T20, which is a star bid, and you're gonna need this star bid, and you're just gonna need a Phillips. Any driver will do. I have mine on a DeWalt, uh, so it'd be a Phillips screwdriver and a star bit uh, for this one's a t20 it's the bottom of the microwave so it's going to take off all these phillips already took off one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve comes out and just move it. this portion here is damaged uh, you can see right there That tooth fell off so if your microwave is not spinning this is the part you want to order and it's usually stamped on there we're looking for sm221 echo and you'll need the star key here the star bit take that off and for this one since it burned off and this is part of the cable this completely came off so you'll be able to you have to pull it off this little tooth I pull that off in order for the new one to go back in. So on the inside you have this little tab and it's gonna link up to this and that's what makes the microwave little plate spin. So it's really easy, just make sure you match it up and you don't even need to match it up while you're installing it, you can just remove it It'll pop right out. And then when you're putting your plate back in, you just have to connect that. It's really simple on that one. And then just match up the holes. Locked in place, put it all back together. it up this is on the inside and then you just gotta wiggle it so it falls in place and there it is microwave is ready to use last thing I gotta do is just test it 